Welcome to TITEC Consult. My name is Emmanuel Cyprian. In this video, we shall be looking at risk management framework training. And then the training we shall be looking at is the risk management framework step one. Risk management framework step one. And what is risk management framework step one? That is the preparation step. According to NIST 837 Rev 2, there is now seven steps in the risk management framework. The first step is prepare. And what is this prepare step? What does it talk about? What do you need to know about it? How do you understand it? Why is it the first step? That is what we shall be looking at in this video. But before we go into details, um, what is the purpose of this preparation step? Let's look at the purpose. The purpose of the prepare step is to carry out essential activities at the organization, mission, and business process and information system levels of the organization to help prepare the organization to manage its security and privacy risk using the risk management framework. So what does this mean? It means that for an organization to effectively carry out the remaining six steps of the risk management framework, they need to prepare for those six steps. And there are some essential activities that are required of each organization before they can successfully execute or carry out the risk management framework steps. Those essential activities is what is found in the preparation step. So which means that for any organizations to deploy information systems into production, it has to go through the risk management framework steps. But the first step is the preparation step. And in the preparation step, there are essential tasks that needs to be carried out. What are those essential tasks? Let's look at some of those essential tasks. Now, under the prepare step, there are 18 tasks that needs to be carried out, although some of these tasks are optional. These tasks are divided into organization level preparation task and system level preparation task. At the organization level preparation task, it means the activities, the essential activities that the organization as a whole needs to execute, needs to carry out in order to successfully prepare or in order to successfully deploy the remaining steps of the risk management framework. Under the organization level task, there are seven tasks. One of those tasks is risk management roles. Risk management roles. This means that the organization needs to determine who are those to take sensitive position, who are those that will be carrying out sensitive position in the execution of the risk management framework steps. Example of the risk management framework roles include the authorizing official, system owner, information owner, common control provider, system security officer, security engineer, uh, privacy engineer. These are some of the risk management framework roles that must be carried out at the organization level before they start executing the remaining steps in the risk management framework. So that is the organization level task under the preparation step. The other portion of the task under the preparation step is the system level task, meaning that there are some essential activities that needs to be performed that needs to be carried out at the system level at the preparation task. Under the 
system level task there are 11 essential activities or tasks although some of these tasks are optional now let me give you example of a task under the system level task one of the example is authorization boundary it means that before they start executing or this, the organization start to put together the risk management framework steps, there is the need to determine the authorization boundary. What is authorization boundary? It means the scope of protection. What are the components that makes up this system that we want to protect? How many databases are involved? How many applications are involved? How many operating systems? What kind of operating system are we talking about here? Who, are the, who is the authorizing official for this system? What is the boundary that it cuts across? So that is what authorization boundary is talking about. And authorization boundary is one of the essential tasks that needs to be carried out at the system level under the preparation task. So you can see here that the preparation task is essential. Before you carry out even your business function anywhere, personally, you need to prepare. So that is what this preparation task is talking about. That is what the preparation step is talking about. That to successfully carry out the remaining six steps of the risk management framework, you need to adequately prepare. You need to put some tasks, some activities in place. You need to write down, you need to document some activities. And that is what the preparation task is talking about. So, for details of each of these RMF steps, please, you read more at NIST 837 Revision 2. And if you want to learn details more hands-on on the risk management framework, please reach out to me at Titec Consults. In my class, we have detailed hands-on for each of the RMF steps. As you can see, there are videos in my channel. You can check them out for each of the RMF steps. And also, I have classes, RMF classes that are coming up in this January. My Saturday classes will be starting January uh, 23rd. And then the evening class will be starting January 18. Please reach out to me for details regarding the schedule, regarding the fee, regarding the focus of the class and what you tend to gain. If this video has been helpful to you, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to comment on this video. And don't forget to turn on your notification button so that whenever I release new content on my channel, you will be notified. Thank you very much.